Welcome to our course Understand Quran and Salah the easy way. Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters. Welcome back to second part of our 10th lesson in which we will learn grammar. Remember that we are always using TPI to learn different grammatical forms of a given verb and also different words. TPI total physical interaction is nothing but you are watching, listening, seeing and say, so please say or repeat with us and also show what uh, you, you mean and we will tell you how to show different ways. The different kinds of words that we speak, write, listen to or, or, or read are classified in English, um, in Arabic language as ism, noun, representing names and attributes, fa'il, a verb, um, which tells us about an action, and harf, which is letter, which joins nouns and or verbs. We have been learning fa'il or verb in the past classes. We have completed fa'il madhi and fa'il mudare. Also note that in Arabic language most of the verbs come from three root letters. They are called root letters like fa'ala, fataha, nasara, daraba and so on. And also we have learned that Arabic language has two tenses. One is fa'il madhi which is done and fa'il mudare which is not done yet. Fa'il madhi is perfect tense and fa'il mudare is imperfect tense. So fa'il mudare is imperfect which is not done yet that is being done or will be done and that's why yaf'alu is translated as he does or he will do. Yaf'aluna they do or they will do. Taf'alu you do or you will do. Taf'aluna you all do or you all will do. Af'alu I do or I will do. Naf'alu we do or we will do. But for the practice sake and as starters, we are just using present tense. He does, they do, you do, you all do, I do, we do. Okay? Depending on the context, depending on the context, you will know whether it is present tense or future tense. So let us practice uh, right from past tense. Repeat after me once. Fa'ala he did. Fa'alu they did. Fa'alta you did. Fa'altum you all did. Fa'altu I did. Fa'alna we did. Can you translate? Fa'ala he did. Fa'alu they did. Fa'alta you did. Fa'altum Fa'altu I did. Fa'alna we did. And repeat after me in Arabic. Fa'ala fa'alu Fa'alta fa'altum Fa'altu fa'alna Okay and we also have learned fa'al mudari' which is you know you use your voice level at a higher you know pitch and also your hand level at eye level Ya fa'alu ya fa'alu ta fa'al ta fa'alu na fa'alu na fa'alu So can you repeat after me Ya fa'alu he does Ya fa'alu na they do Taf'alu you do. Taf'aluna you all do. Af'alu I do. Naf'alu we do. MashaAllah. Repeat after me in Arabic. Yaf'alu yaf'aluna. Taf'alu taf'aluna. Af'alu naf'alu. Yaf'alu yaf'aluna. Taf'alu taf'aluna. Af'alu naf'alu. Okay. And we have seen that in fa'al madhi the endings change. Fa'ala fa'alu. Fa'alta. Fa'altum. Fa'altu. Fa'alna. Something has gone so the ends are visible and using the ends we can know uh, who, what is it that has gone. Similarly here checking at the ends. Fa'alta. Oh you have done it. Fa'altum. You all have done it. Fa'altu. I have done it and so on. Similarly, for fa'al mudare, something is coming, so I see the beginnings only. So, based on the beginnings, I know who has done it. And also, I told you about those trees, you know, fa'ala, you know, the, somebody has planted a big tree, so fa'al already he has planted, so fa'al or his tree is visible. So, first comes fa'al, next comes who has done it. And here, 
for fa'al mudari you say yasir yaf'al and many yasir yaf'alun tawfiq taf'al many tawfiq taf'alun ana af'al wa nahnu naf'al okay you can remember it this way also whichever is convenient but with more practice inshallah you will learn these different forms which are very precious which come in the quran 10000 times you know at least maybe they come more uh, you know uh, uh, this is just a rough guess in today's class we will learn imperative and prohibitive order and prohibition how do you order in arabic using the same three root letters fa'ala you see we are making all these forms you know fa'ala fa'alu fa'alta fa'alu ya fa'alu ta fa'alu mashallah from the same three root letters arabic language is extremely powerful with three root letters you can make not only you know 10 20 but in fact more than two three hundred words uh, it's very very powerful so today's in today's class we will learn imperative and negative using the same three root letters for Allah so repeat after me if I'll do, if I'll do. and uh, the TPI the action is you bring your hand from top close to your mouth and make it horizontal as if you're ordering something asking something ordering uh, it is in used in the sense of asking also but the form is like this if I'll do if I'll do if I'll do, if I'll do. using four fingers just bring them down as if you're ordering and the action will tell us whether it is singular or plural okay again if I'll do 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 and then la tafal you see you can keep your hands closed like this and then open your right hand and you know as if stopping someone so say la tafal don't do and with four fingers la tafalu don't do again la tafal don't do la tafalu don't do la tafal don't do la tafalu don't do now there are hundreds of words in the quran on these patterns so let us practice now all of them together repeat after me please if i'll do if i'll do if i'll do la tafal don't do la tafalu don't do can you translate if i'll do if i'll do la tafal don't do la tafalu don't do if i'll do if i'll do la tafal don't do la tafalu don't do now repeat in arabic thinking what you're saying okay افعل افعلو لا تفعل لا تفعلو افعل افعلو لا تفعل لا تفعلو افعل افعلو لا تفعل لا تفعلو ما شاء الله you have completed no most of the table let us do the complete table once again and now we are coming you know ما شاء الله we are covering the most important part with this everything after that is easy so repeat after me from starting from past tense okay fa'ala fa'alu fa'alta fa'altum fa'altu fa'alna yaf'alu yaf'aluna taf'alu taf'aluna af'alu naf'alu if'al if'alu لا تفعل لا تفعلو لا تفعل لا تفعلو ما شاء الله again فعل فعلو فعل فعلو الماضي horizontal level lower voice level فعل فعلو فعلت فعلتم فعلت فعلنا يفعلو يفعلونا فعل مضارع high level voice and your eye hand level is at high level تفعلو تفعلونا افعلو نفعلو افعل افعلو لا تفعل لا تفعلو ما شاء الله this way you can continue and practice and be just be thorough about that 
these uh, please one note one more thing we have learned these preposition I mean pronouns who whom ka kum e na they also come attached with verbs for example khalaqa is one verb khalaqa he created okay so khalaqa who he created allah created him khalaqa hum he created them khalaqa ka he created you khalaqa kum he created you all khalaqa ni see it is not e it is khalaqa ni he created me and khalaqa na he created us he created us so it comes as objects also who hum ka kum ina and khalaqa ha he created her so please remember it not only comes with khalaqa it can come with any verb in any form like yakhluquhu yakhluquhum yaf'aluhu yaf'aluhum yaf'aluka yaf'alukum it can come with any of these verbs that we have learned in learning tip see our brain has huge capacity largely unused that's what we learned in the beginning so we create we should create as many flashes as possible to learn a word and take a deep breath whenever you feel you know you're you're just in one position and 95% of retention is there if we read write say see and do think big and colorful learn with love and enthusiasm and always learn the meanings with an example but whatever you learn you forget this is human mind so if you learn 100 things then within an hour you forget almost 70 per 70 things this is according to research if you revise after 1 hour then in one day you forget 70 things if you revise those 100 things again at the end of the day then that retains for longer time but after one week again you forget 70 things and if you revise th those 100 things after one week then you forget them after one month revise them after one month you retain them for six months so the thing is it's like this you learn 100 things now within an hour 70 are gone you revise them so it will retain there longer after one day 70 are gone you revise them after one week 70 will be gone you revise them after one month 70 will be gone so this is how the human brain is and forgetting is a blessing especially for the one who is struck with some you know sad uh, case and so on so let us practice according to the way brain has designed that is we should revise after one hour one day one week one month one semester we are learning lot of things so we need revision and that's why in the light of that we have introduced very simple homeworks about which we will talk in the next lessons insha allah so brothers and sisters in 10 lessons so far we have learned 58 words which have come in the quran which occur in the quran 26689 times inshallah we'll keep learning in the following lessons we'll see you then subhanallah wa bihamdihi subhanakallahumma wa bihamdika nashhadu an la ilaha illa anta nastaghfiruka wa natubu ilaik wassalamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh Brothers and sisters assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh welcome to our course understand quran and salah the easy way the easy way, the easy way. يقولون الإعراب